Hi everybody, I have been now tuning my 1.9 liter turbo diesel uh, synchro value for about one hour and as you saw I was able to get it under 2 liters per hour at 2000 rpms and 0.4 liters at idling and the value I'm having at the moment is 6 6.6 and it used to be 0.0, .0 and my injection correction values were totally off and now they are almost level so it's working at least at the moment really well I haven't yet test driven so I don't know what the effect is uh, at the moment I'm using my tuning program I tried with regular program also and the idle fuel consumption stayed the same though so the program doesn't change the uh, fuel consumption on the idle and how, how you need to do the testing or the setting is that you uh, when you look at the values you close all the electricity like fans radio and lights in park mode so I have only parking lights so that's how you get the lowest values uh, if you had the lights on fuel consumption is usually 0.6 liters or a little bit higher depending on your car and on the engine size I recommend uh, loosening the power cable for the electric fan otherwise it will start to run run in some point so it it affects a lot to the results on the fuel consumption and the setting is basically done uh, by loosening these three bolts 13 millimeter wrench and after that I recommend that you have some kind of tool so you can easily uh, turn the setting to each direction and try to do small changes first and if you have your uh, setting of the drive belt install it correctly there shouldn't be no collisions for in inside the engine but still I would recommend trying to rotate few rounds before you make any before you start the engine just to be sure otherwise you can bend some valves inside the engine and that that's not good it's really tricky because the changes here are tiny and it takes time to get it right so for me I was able to get it to 6 degrees quite easily but to 6.6 .6, it took a lot of time to get it there it went over and under and over and under so take your time when you find the lowest fuel consumption on the idle after that you need to start looking the injection correction values and when you get the minimum uh, distortion between those values then you are probably closest to the lowest fuel consumption also so the minimum injection uh, values tells you which, is, which should be the best best values for your engine and the zero probably isn't the right value because in some cars they have printed or, or written some values on the valve cover or the cam belt cover and that should be close to the correct value but like you see on my car there's no values written so I needed to do manual trial, trial and error and I will post the results if I'm able to get my fuel consumption even lower. Thanks for watching and keep tuning your cars.